right. Okay, we'll be right back with Richard Ostro, and we're going to say hello to a special guest in just a couple minutes. So stay right there. This is very interesting, especially what's coming up. Okay, welcome back. Talking with Richard Ostro, Carnivora.com, a sponsor of this program. And our sponsors not only believe in exposure and doing well in their business ventures, but they believe in the program. They believe in you folks and the values that we all still share in this country that is under such horrible siege and has sustained such incredible damage from traitors and criminals in the nation's capital and our controllers, of course, in Tel Aviv and ultimately the City of London banking cartel in London, England. And you know the name of that game. All right, Richard, let's uh, go ahead and say hello to our special guest, if you would. Sure. This is quite an extraordinary story, if I may. One of many. This gentleman's name is Vaughn Best. Very appropriate because he got the best deal in town here. Uh Now, it was... Two or three years ago, if time serves me right, and he can fix you up on that one. But they gave him weeks to live. He's not you know, supposed I, to be I, here. I, I, I'm sorry, I got to stop you there. If I if I hear that again, I may become physically ill on the radio at some point. <laughs> those those people, those alleged healers, right, those right. alleged <laughs> doctors, ought to be locked away for that. It it there is nothing more criminal, immoral, or insane than to tell someone they're going to die in weeks. Well, How the hell well, do they know? Well, they know Who are they? They Who can't are give they? enough chemo to do the job. That's they're, one way. Well, that, that's where I was ultimately going with this, but beside that, who are they to tell anyone what their future is, will, or might be? They don't know. And how many people have you seen, Richard, of people coming to you or in life who are what they call terminally ill, who decide to make the move, cut out the meat and dairy products, stop the processed foods, go organic, vegan, or raw, and all of a sudden, they start to get better, just on the basis of that. And yet these docs so-called die. Yes, and these doctors tell people they're going to die. And 99% of them, you know what they do, folks? They die right on schedule. Go ahead, please. Big money in death, mayhem, and murder in the U.S. pharmaceutical of A. It sure is. So, back Mur- to Vaughn. Murder, Inc. Yep. Murder, Inc., that's right. Uh, good way to put it. People are learning very quickly, and uh, they're pulling together. It's a wonderful thing. So, Vaughn now. Vaughn really was in bad shape. Um, I can't say what it is he had, but let's just say it's what a, a man contracts at normally an older age much of the time. And his numbers were over 1,500, which, if anybody is reading between the lines here, is usually not survivable in the world of convention. Now, that's a PSA Uh, count, ladies and gentlemen, of 1,500. Now I didn't say that. (laughs) I didn't either. Yeah, I know. It must have been a glitch. Uh, (laughs) <laughs> We've heard the controversy about fit PSA and, and all that lately. And right. if, you, if you want to do some studying on it, go ahead, enter PSA controversy or PSA fraud, whatever. It is a marker, but it doesn't necessarily mean what the doctors tell you it means. All right? Right. Now, well, they'll always do it in the name of money, of course. Uh, absolutely. I have a friend who yeah. had a, a PSA of uh, 30, something like that. And the, the damn the damn butchers wanted to literally go in and do a complete prostatectomy on the basis of a PSA of 35, if I remember, I was right around there. And I said, what? Anyway, I worked with this individual, 
and his PSA is already down to five after four months. All right? I believe it. And he is now on carnivore, so it's headed even lower. That's my guess. All well, right. your guess is a very educated one. Uh, yeah. I'll let Vaughn tell his yeah. story. What I'd like to do is uh, okay. bring Vaughn on and say hello, but then we have a break, and I want him to start on his story after the break. Hello, Vaughn. Are you there? Yes, I am, uh, gentlemen, and I would be pleased to uh, let you know the good things of that that have come to me as a result of uh, discovering uh, carnivora. How did you find out about it, Vaughn? Where did you hear about it? Well, I uh, had a, a job that had a high uh, security instrument on the airplane that the that flew uh, 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 one of our presidents around and. Uh, uh, and, and the fellow that worked for me that had to keep that instrument uh, calibrated, and he told me where he had gone and why and uh, what uh, was. And then I overlook, I kind of forgot about it for a long time, uh-huh. and then later it came back to me, and I then uh, uh, called you and uh, got uh, started on it. Called Richard. Yes. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. Stand by, Vaughn, if you would, just for a minute, and we'll take our commercial break and, and come back and hear uh, your story. Richard, uh, you've been at this now 10, 12 years, right, since you took the company About over? 13. 13. Okay. How many people have you been able to assist? We'll leave it at that. Is it growing every I year? I don't need exact. Is. I don't. I don't need exact numbers, but I mean, yeah, I, we're I obviously. Even tell you that. We're Let's seeing. Just say I'm on the. Go ahead, sir. We're seeing a potential, constant, increase because of the results. Well, that's right. I mean, we're getting, we're bursting at the seams here. We have to do something in our lab to accommodate demand. That's going to take us nine months before we really break out. So, we're not hurting in any way but we're supposed to be doing what it's doing this is what we're supposed to do i always thought the world was a good place and we were supposed to do things like this well it oh, is and, it and you are like it is and you Thank are you. but it isn't <laughs> right. the world the world is far from what we want it to be and exactly. my god the, the number of uh, tragically ill people stumbling around and and staggering to their early and unnecessary deaths is is outrageous